Hey guys, welcome back to another Trials of the Nomus DLC. But this is a glitch, so I'm going to show you how to get to that that gray box down there and I want to show you how to get down there. You guys really want to sh you guys showed me all the support that I wanted, so thank you guys so much for showing all that support and now I'm going to show you how to do this glitch. So, you guys want to go over here and just look this way, go to the left. And then you'll see my mess over here. Sorry, I, I had something that went wrong. But you want to place your decoy right here. Place it down. And then you want to throw your imp by pressing LB. And then you want to sprint tackle, but sometimes it doesn't work and sometimes it does. So just keep doing it and then it should work. So pretty much I usually do is that I just aim and then fire at this and then put my decoy down. You see how I'm almost falling out of the map. I don't use my sprint tackle because um I usually throw my imp and then sprint tackle sometimes and it usually works but usually the imp does the best results. If you fly up like that, that means you did it wrong. So you want to go un like go down. You don't want to go up. So you place your decoy down, and then you want to keep your cursor right here. Then you want to throw your imp. If you go up like that, it means you're doing it wrong, like I am right now. It's not really a wrong or a right thing because it's always random so it can glitch you out and sometimes it'll just not nothing will happen and you just mess up so you always want to put your decoy down because your imp always responds faster than any other ability that you got it's like I'm going up and I keep failing so I'm just gonna keep trying Hopefully this will not take long on video, and if it does take long, I'll probably like skip parts. Because I literally had had to do my my first time doing this. I was just messing around, and trying all the walls in the in the trials of the gnomes puzzle place, and I just did it wrong. See how difficult it is? It's always random because it will just glitch you up or it just glitch you down. It's always random. It's not. Oh, it's it's a hundred percent. No, it it doesn't work like that, buddy. So you just want to keep the cursor right here. Place decoy down. Then you want to place throw imp. So I almost went out of the map. I went under. And then you should usually sprint tackle to force yourself out of the map. But sometimes when you go under the map, it doesn't count as touching the ground, so you can't sprint tackle. You see how um, that affects you from getting out of the map. So you want to place your decoy, throw your amp. And that time the imp didn't, didn't even affect my height or going underground. Okay, guys, I'm gonna keep trying. Um, I must probably skip this part. It's gonna probably take a good amount of time, so be right back. Here we go. Now I'm back, and that's how you do the glitch. And yes, I've been down here. I just did the video about that one thing, so. And that's how you get all the map, guys, for the Trials of the Nomus. And this is how you get to the gray box. Make sure you don't go near it. You have 50% freezing your game and 50% transfer. Trans 
back to the, the map. That's what I usually use for my going back to the map. But that usually lags out my game most of the time, most of the time so. My own fault. Yeah, everything down here is walkable. And mostly all the, even the, all the boundaries. It's a really crazy glitch. And thank you guys so much for all the support and almost reached a thousand. So if I do reach a thousand before this video is out, hopefully I'll um, thank you guys for all the support and it's just absolutely amazing. But anyways, I want to talk about this glitch because it's really insane. You can see everything in the Trials of the Gnome, Gnomus. And you can see the the puzzle and all the signs and all the things. It's a pain in the butt to get in here, but as you can see, how I fall through the map after I did that, I used my imp and then I sprint tackled after I put my decoy down to get through there, and you fall out of the map. That's the only way I found how to get out of the map in this this area, and this that's the perfect way. I, I I personally think it's pretty easy. All you need to do is keep trying. You don't have to move. You just put your decoy down, throw your imp, sprint tackle if you go under, and then you should get out. I wonder what this thing is. Let me guys let me know in the comments below if you're thankful about this. This glitch I, I showed you guys, and hopefully you guys enjoyed. And see, I went too near. I'm out of the map. So you have to watch out. If you do go near it, you probably will get transported back up like I did. Yeah, it doesn't work automatically like I was trying to do but thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed the video just let me know in the comments below and if you really enjoyed and want to share it to your friends please share the video because that always helps out a lot too and what the hell is that what the uh, that's weird Okay guys, so um, comment down below if you really enjoyed and if you want to talk to me or something, just let me know. And If you guys are deciding to subscribe to my channel, please do. I got plenty of content. I always listen to you guys' feedback, even to the new, new subscribers. So let me know in the comments below what you guys want to see, like games, game modes, what characters in the games you want me to showcase. And what you guys want me to showcase in the DLC. And I'll try my best because the keys are very impossible to get right now. So, yes. I have to wait till October to play the DLC. It's getting ridiculous with this DLC. And I seem like I'm the only, I'm like the only person that does not like the DLC as it is. It's pretty cool. It's nice looking, but it's all for looks. But anyways, I'm getting off track because I'm I don't this DLC pisses me off to the fullest. <laughs> but if you really enjoyed, please share and all that subscribing. And if you want to help me out a lot, please on turn those notifications on because that will tell you every time I upload and then you guys can see my video without just guessing when my video is going to be on. It, you don't have to, but it gives me a lot of support if you guys do. And if you really guys enjoyed, leave a like. It if I already said that, oh, then okay. But anything else I'm forgetting? No, I, I guess not. Okay, guys. Hopefully you guys are enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and peace out, and stay awesome. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this amazing glitch. And let's talk about this gray box down there and what it is. And I'm pretty sure it's a spawn thing that spawns the guardians and 
all that so that's probably why you get transported when you touch it when you go up here in good thing my game did not freeze okay guys and if you're wondering if you can do this on all consoles you can you can do it on PC I tested it and I did it on Xbox one I tested it right now I do not know because on PS4 I do not have a PS4 if you guys the PS4 fans are asking me if I have a PS4 I have a PSN name that like Shadow XO I don't have a system because I don't have money to buy a system for a PS4 so I apologize to my PS4 fans and okay guys peace out and stay awesome like always and I'll catch you guys later peace